GNSS base receivers or base stations are very expensive. Here's one from a very popular brand called Reach. It's the RS2 and it's for $2,500. Here is a very respected brand, Leica, for $14,000. DJI makes one for $3,800. And here's one from China for $2,269. Even the cheapest hobbyish or amateur product is still $575. Why we should make our own base station, you ask? Well, number one, because the base usually doesn't move, so therefore it's easier to make. On the other hand, a DIY rover will not make sense to make by yourself because it has to be lightweight, portable, precise, and very easy to use in the field. Even though this is an open source software, it is actually uh, very well done. Um, whoever makes this, Stefal did a very nice job um, with the user interface, the graph, the map, everything looks really good and easy, easy to use. I have the full parts list in the video description. Please kindly use my link. It helps support my channel. Here's a full view of all the parts. This is a Raspberry Pi or you can also use Orange Pi. This is the GNSS receiver. This is the most expensive part at $200. This is a PoE splitter, which splits data and power. The software installation was pretty easy because of the great detail of instruction given from GitHub and there's also uh, images that you can flash directly to your Raspberry Pi and, um, and you can just execute the commands that is uh, detailed here on the GitHub. I also updated my uBlox F9 GNSS receiver firmware using the U-Blox U-Center. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel to see more do-it-yourself video like these and support my channel. Thank you.